Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. This is our 44th tutorial of Power BI. In the previous class, we have learned about apps in Power BI services. So I hope guys you are cleared with the concept of apps in Power BI services. So in today's class, we will study some more feature about Power BI services. So our today class topic is dashboard. So firstly, we will cover what is dashboard. Dashboard is a visual representation of the data which are most important information is required to achieve one or more goals. It is a consolidated and arranged on a single screen so that information can be controlled at a glance. So let's understand the dashboard with practical. So let's go to the Power BI services guys. So guys here we can see we have multiple reports are here. So let me click on this 41st tutorial. So here we can see all the pages of the report. So let's go to the sales analysis page and from here guys we will only take important and key visuals and create our dashboard. So let's say this card visual I want to display on my dashboard. So I simply go here and under this visual guys you can see this pin icon. So we need to click on this pin icon. So now this box has pop up. So from here guys you need to select the tile theming either you can select use destination theme or keep current theme. So I will go with use destination theme. And here guys you can enter your dashboard name. So you guys can type any name here but I am entering my name here. So guys my dashboard name is Shubham dashboard. And now you can click on this pin button. So here are two options guys create mobile layout and go to dashboard. So I will click this go to dashboard. So here is the dashboard guys and we guys can see we have pinned this card tile on our dashboard. And now I am again go to our report and take some more visuals. And now this time I will pin this pie chart visual to the dashboard. So let me click on this pin button. And we can see again it's getting the same pop up. Now you need to click on this pin button and guys if you have any other dashboard and you want to pin this visual under that dashboard so you need to click this drop down and you will get to see more dashboards. For now only we have only one dashboard which name is Shubham dashboard. So let me click on this pin button and again go to the go to dashboard. So guys in this way I will take more visual and pin to the dashboard. Now go to the comparison page and I want this style pinned to the dashboard. And close this. And again go to the sales analysis page and I also want this pie chart into the dashboard. So I will pin this pie chart into the dashboard. And now go to the dashboard guys. So guys this is our dashboard and we can see multiple visual on one page. So you can organize the tiles from here. So guys in this way you can change the size of the tiles and make it organized according to your requirement. So guys you can also change the place of your tiles. So let me drag this card here. Simply drag and drop here. So in this way guys you can add multiple tiles from the report and make it into the one pager. And now guys let's suppose we want to see the sales of the bread. So guys if I click here on this pie chart. So this page is directly take you to the report. It will not interact there like report. So you can say that it is a summarized version of report. So you guys can also create multiple dashboard of similar report. And now we will understand the few difference about dashboard and report. And you guys can see here. Here is my dashboard which name is Shubham dashboard. So you guys can directly go to dashboard from here and now understand the difference between report and dashboard. So guys dashboard is a one pager and report is a combination of multiple pages. So this is the first difference guys between report and dashboard and this dashboard is less interactive as compared to report because if you want to see the detailed version of a specific product or any country any record we can't see that in dashboard. But we can see this thing in report. So this could be the second difference guys between dashboard and reports. And the last difference guys 
which I would like to tell you, Power BI dashboard can't be sliced and diced with slicer. But under report, we can slice with slicer. So if I go here in report, and if I select this slicer, so we can see here, there is no pin icon is appear here. That means we can't pin this style to the dashboard. And we have few more visual guys which we can't pin to the dashboard. So you guys need to explore yourself about that visuals. So guys, these are the three major difference of dashboard and reports. Now guys, I will show you the icon of the dashboard. So I am going to the workspace which name is Shubham. So guys, this green color icon representing as a dashboard. And this blue icon is representing as a report. And this orange icon is represent as a data set. And last we will learn about how to delete this dashboard. So you need to simply go here guys and click on three dots. And once you click it, you can see this remove option. So you need to click on this remove option. So are you sure you want to permanently delete this dashboard? Yes, I want to delete it permanently. So let me click on this delete button. So guys, we can see our dashboard has deleted from here. I hope guys you are clear with the difference of report and dashboard. So guys stay tuned with us for more learning about Power BI. And please follow this channel and don't forget to like, subscribe and share. And don't forget to press bell icon else you will miss an update. And those who are new to this channel kindly like, share and subscribe in your network. Thank you so much guys.